Oh, new species. Little cichlids everywhere. Look at the girth on that thing. Look at the colors on this guy. Look how many cichlids are down there. We've been catching stuff every single net. Oh, I see a bigger fish in there. Wow, look, oh my God. Welcome back to Rob's Aquas, guys. In today's video, we're checking out a new spot. So we're at this canal, it's super polluted. The water honestly doesn't look the best, but we're going to see if we can't catch any fish out of here. I really have no idea what could be in these waters because we've never been here before. But before we get into today's video, if you like the video, subscribe channel and turn on post notifications. And let's Let's get right into it so i have a trap we haven't set it yet i gotta find a spot to put it because there's like a lot of crap in the water i don't really know where the best spot is but this water is also just like really disgusting so i'm gonna do my best not to get into contact with it because i have no protective gear on me right now and these oil slicks aren't making me feel too confident so we got my long net so we'll still be able to punch through here ew Oh god. It's just like straight sludge. I don't know if there's any fish in here at all, but we're gonna find out today. I'm scared to like throw this around, honestly. Ew. As I throw it around. Let's see. Oh! Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh wait, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. What are these? What are those? Wait, what are are these baby catfish? Oh wow. Some tiny little catfish. I think these are hopolo catfish, just tiny little babies. They could be baby. Oh. <laughs> it just shot in my face. <laughs> It got in my mouth too a little bit. But okay, so first species discovered here. Not, that was not long, literally first net. We caught two of these little catfish. I'm not quite sure what they are, but we do have our new cooler. So we're going to run these up there, probably grab a trap and set it in somewhere in this area because there are fish here. I'm probably in that little pocket right there. The water seems to get a little deeper and we're going to keep punching these weeds to put these fish in. They keep slapping this mud in my face. <laughs> I see it. You see it? <laughs> yeah, I feel it. Here we go, guys. We got these two right here. I'm going to throw them in right now. Get some of this water in here. Ew. Ew, look at this stuff. This water is literally black. Oh, that's gross. But luckily this cooler locks up like this. We're gonna grab the trap and get it set now that we definitely know there are actually fish here. We've literally never been here before. First time fishing it. My aerator is dead, but I got another in the car thanks to you guys. So we're gonna get a new aerator. We're gonna get the trap. We're gonna set it in this pocket right there. And yeah, we should be good. So we're gonna take this trap right here. We're just gonna throw it right where we just net. We got some cat food loaded in there. So if there's catfish in here, we might catch an absolute load of them. We're just gonna throw the string right there. There's like literally no current in here, so it should be good. But we're just gonna start netting around again while we let that sit and do its thing. This stuff is like so disgusting. I'm scared, I'm scared to touch it. Bunch of little fish. Okay, so we got baby cichlids in here as well. Look at these guys, look at that. That's a baby jewel cichlid. So nothing too, too crazy yet, but signs of life, pretty nice. Oh, we got even more baby cichlids in here. I just saw a few, but he <laughs> ran away in these weeds. There's definitely probably water bugs in here as well, but this stuff is all pretty gross. We're gonna do our best to try to get every single weed we pull out back in the water. Look at the little cichlid flopping around down there. Look. Yeah. There's even more. Look, I'll try to get them all. There's okay, so little baby jewel cichlid. Where did he go? He flopped around somewhere, but we got a little baby jewel. Oh. We got a little baby jewel cichlid right here. So that's pretty neat. Okay, we might actually have found a juicy little spot. Look, an even smaller little baby fish. Microscopic. So there's a <laughs> bunch of small little guys in this canal. We're gonna keep fishing and see what else we could catch. So so far, guys, we've caught a jewel cichlid and those catfish. I think they're hoplos. I <laughs> broke my net. Guys, wish list in the description below. I don't think I'm fixing in that but we're gonna keep netting around it's nice because this net kind of like scrapes the bottom of it because this canal is built in a way that it's kind of like really it's soft at the bottom there's it's just like straight substrate so it kind of works well oh yeah look a third fish oh new species little baby tilapia okay so there's cichlids in here that's we can confirm good little spot just gotta see what else we could catch oh little ghost shrimp not bad not cool but like not bad we know what they're eating on oh Another little fish. I think that's another baby jewel, although it could be another species. I'm not too sure. Throw them back in the water. We're just going to keep working our way on down this canal. We're trying to beat the sun down, but we do have my flashlight, so we should be fine regardless. I'm going to just throw this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look. Even more little baby fish. Yeah, so no big cichlids yet. That We're bound to catch one. This is the biggest one we've caught so far. Time to start sorting through this garbage. I said I wasn't going to touch the water, but here I am. Definitely throwing a pair of gloves up on the wish list. Oh, 
Wait, look. Barely saw it down here, but the little spot gave it away. I think this might be a little baby Jack Dempsey. Yes, it is. First keeper of the day. These guys are more exotic than the rest of them. So if we catch any of these, we're definitely going to be holding on to them. But it's a tiny baby little Jack Dempsey. Um, Anybody else? Oh, I just realized the aerator is working. I just can't hear it because it's closed. Uh, this little Jack Dempsey, we're going to get added in. We're going to grab the flashlight too because the light's going down. And we're just going to keep ripping up all these weeds to see what else we can net up. All right, guys, right back into it. We got the flashlight. We brought the equipment down here so we don't have to run up the hill and take more time when we're catching stuff. But we got this net right here. We're gonna drop it down. Catching a lot of little snails as well. Trying my best not to come coming. Oh, little fish. Look, little cichlids everywhere. So these guys are also little tilapia, I believe. Yeah, those are definitely little tilapia. That's sick. Uh, oh, little mosquito fish. Okay, so there are live bears in this. This guy's not too big. But we'll get him back in the water. Oh, another one. Oh, this one's fatter. Okay, that's pretty neat. A fat little mosquito fish. So we got three species so far in here. Anybody else in this? Oh, look, a molly. Look at that. <laughs> so cool. Okay, four species identified in the new spot. That's really sick. What is, oh, wait, what is this? Hello. Oh my God. Look at the size of this thing. What? <laughs> Is that? Is there something wrong with him? What? <laughs> what? Dude, it's a fat molly. I, he's got to have like a disease or something. There's no reason this thing should be this fat. Look at the size. We got to keep this one. This one's coming home for sure. Look at the girth on that thing. <laughs> it's about to pop. We're going to get this guy in our little cooler right here. Look at that fat guy. That thing is so sick. We're going to get him in there. Boop. Look at him. He's a big pork roll. Double wide. <laughs> Butterball. Like, there's so many options I think we could call him, but so far, this canal is really producing. I really like this spot. Not seeing anything else in this net right here except this fat snail. Monster apple snail, fifth species identified. We're just going to get right back into it. This is... Ew. I'm glad we came. This is really sick. Let's see. Anybody home? Any fish in this net? Oh, yep. Okay, so we're gonna, I think we might catch fish every single net. Just because there's so many little baby cichlids in here. That net was pretty. Look, look, look. More live bears. More little mosquito fish and mollies and stuff. Okay, that's actually sick. Oh, yeah. This spot is sick. I like it. Oh, we're just gonna keep working our way down. I don't know how far we're gonna go. We're just gonna keep going. These grass mats are like the perfect habitat for all this stuff. Hoping we could catch some more aquarium fish. This net might snap. We might just go until the net breaks because I don't think I have another net like this and it's really the perfect one to be fishing this spot. Oh, bigger fish, bigger fish. There we go. There we go. Nice little jewel cichlid. That's perfect. We're not going to keep it. We have nothing to do with it. We're just going to put them back. Little cichlid right here. Pretty cool. Probably a tilapia. That seems to be one of the more common finds here, but... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Stop. What was that? I saw color. Ooh, whoa. What is that? What? It... Oh my God. Look at the color. Hey, <laughs> look at the colors on this guy. That thing is beautiful. I don't know what species this is. If you guys do know, please comment down below. But that is a beautiful fish. It's got like yellows across the top, reds along the bottom. That thing is gorgeous. <laughs> it's super hard to handle too. But we're just going to see if there's anything else living in this mess right here. Little mosquito fish right there. Another mosquito fish. Okay, cool. So there's a lot of smaller fish along with these cichlids. Pretty cool find. We're going to get this guy in the cooler though real quick. Oh, <laughs> he did it himself. But this this canal is actually really sick. I'm having a great time. All right, right back up to this fat grass mat. Oh, this stuff is nasty, but it's producing fish. So I'm kind of going to just deal with it. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. What is this? I see big movement. Big movement. What is this? Oh, it's another little catfish. Oh, ew, ew. Stop. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, this stuff smells like badussy. <laughs> <laughs> But we got another one of these catfish. I'm not gonna be keeping them because I have nowhere to put them. Um, we're gonna just put them back in this water, but it's cool to see we found a little hoplo catfish spot. We're gonna just, uh, oh, cichlid. Oh, another jewel. Cool little cichlid, cool little jewel. All sizes, definitely a healthy population in this canal. Anybody else? Pretty cool finds so far. I don't think we got any cool little exotic fish in here. Um, that's fine though. Get this mess back in the water. I'm touching this stuff anyway, so I might as well just throw it in. <laughs> mm. Rose. All right, let's get right back into it. Good net, good net. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at the bottom of the net. Look how many cichlids are down there. Oh yeah, good group, good group. We got some cichlids right here, some mollies. Oh, lost in the sauce. So we got a little cichlid. I saw more. Yeah, okay. So this little mud pit right here has a bunch of these little cichlids in it. Because this is like the bottom of the net. I see a molly. This terrain is not ideal for picking fish up, but we got mosquito fish, 
two different little cichlids. I really want to catch more of those Jack Dempsey's that we caught earlier, but I think that might be it for this net. I'm not seeing any movement. We're gonna keep, oh, look. No, hey, this spot couldn't get any better. Look, there's a crawfish in here. That is awesome. I don't, hopefully there's a chance we catch some blues. I'm not too sure. We might have to come back again, guys, for a part two to try to find, find more crawfish, but that is a sick net. Okay, okay, I actually really enjoy this. This spot is producing. This is really cool. So we're gonna get these guys back in the water. Get right back to beating it. Oh, it gets kind of deep right there. But we'll see if we pulled anything up. Deeper waters could mean bigger fish. So hopefully, you know, we pull up a bigger fish. Because these little cichlids and stuff are really cool, but I want to catch some crazy stuff. Ew. That is vile. That is actually disgusting. Oh, wait. What? Dude, there's a turtle in here. What? I was like, I felt something hard. I was like, what was that? Oh, no. Stop. Don't run. Don't run. Don't run. Look at that. Look at that. Ow. Oh my god. Ow. Look at that. There's a turtle. Dude, what are you doing down there? Here, you could go back, buddy. Or you could hang around, you know. I don't mind. Oh, oh he's gone. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. I was, I, I was so confused. I was like, what was that? That was like a big mud blob. I thought it was like a coconut or something. <laughs> Oh, little crawfish. Okay, so the muddy stuff has the crawfish and apparently turtles. And <laughs> I guess we didn't catch any little cichlids in that net. We didn't catch any mollies, nothing too, too cool. So we'll just throw this sludge back in that <laughs> canal. This is really sick. Like, I'm having a great time. Look, he's still hanging out with us. Guys, comment down below a name for the turtle. I'm thinking Crush. I think we should name him Crush. Would have been really nice to get here in the daytime, but you know, things happen. Let's see. I don't think I caught much weeds in there. So now we have a decision to make. I'm not catching too many fish. I could have scared them all away. Not really quite too sure why we're not catching as many fish. Here's some of that trash. We'll keep going down the canal. We got pretty good like footing here. So we're gonna be able to fish it pretty easily. So we'll just keep working our way down closer to the tunnel where most of the pollution is. Um, yeah, well, I, let's just keep going. Yeah, this net's gonna snap. So we'll just keep going until it does. Huge water wall. I think that might be why we're catching more fish. Oh, no, we just, stop. I just caught one on its way back in the water. Beautiful little jewel cichlid right here. Look at that guy. Gorgeous little fish. I might honestly stop picking them up because they're catching so- Oh, wait, wait, <laughs> wait, wait, what's all your old partner? So we caught some bigger fish in this net. We got this guy, this guy right here, and big old tilapia and a jewel cichlid. So many little cichlids all over this canal. <laughs> there's literally too many of these things. Oh man, there's so many fish. <laughs> Look. Another one of these. Is this the one of those catfish? What? Is, wait, 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 wait. This is something different. Oh, wait, no. Never mind. It's another one of these little catfish. But all these cichlids. I'm trying to get everything I could see right now back in the water. There's literally too many fish for me to keep up with. This is <laughs> this is really good. Just rip through this real quick. Oh, look. It's another one of those really cool mollies. Look at this guy. Big, chunky guy. That thing is... Wow. He's really cool. He's like a mottled color. <laughs> he's different for sure. Real quick, we'll just sift through the rest of this net. See if we can't find anything. Oh, oh, what was that? Oh, nice. Oh, no, please stop. Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> nice. We got a little Jack Dempsey here. So Jack Dempsey and another Molly, a mosquito is literally tearing me up right now. <laughs> God, it's getting bad. We'll just sift through this really quick just to see if there's any more cool stuff, any more crawfish, anything worth keeping. Not seeing much. We'll just throw this back in the water. Oh, <laughs> little Joe Cichlid tagging along. Oh my God, look, more cichlids, more cichlids. <laughs> This place, this place is literally packed. It might just be because it's summer that, you know, they're breeding like crazy. A lot of really cool fish in here. Some jewels, some uh, tilapia. We'll get them back in the water. And we'll get these guys in our little keeper cooler. Keeper cooler open. So far, we're doing pretty good. We got those two weird little catfish. That weird barb looking thing. I, that's what I'd assume it is. And then that balloon platy molly thing. And we got another Jack Dempsey and another balloon molly. So these are some really fire finds. We're gonna keep netting around. We're limited on time here right now tonight, guys, because we got one flashlight battery and one net, and we're doing a lot of damage on the net and using the flashlight. So we're gonna net around for a little bit longer, see what else we catch. We've been catching stuff every single net. So we know this spot's proven. We could come back for a part two. Just like and subscribe if you wanna see that. Comment down below, let me know. But we're gonna pick up the net, keep going. I'm hyped, I'm hyped, I'm in it. <laughs> it does smell like the dusty around here, though. <laughs> Look at the bend of this neck guy. There's no way I could get this back in my car. We got some really thick pads here. We're gonna try to net through here. Hopefully the net doesn't break on us, but it seems like it might be getting to that point. And, oh, no. 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 It just broke. Oh. No, dude. I'm gonna get another net on the wish list, guys, but last net of the day, I guess. This thing just snapped. Oh my God, there's a massive bug on me. 
Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. We're gonna see what this last net pulled up. Let's see if we. Oh, 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 oh! What was that? Oh, wait, wait! I see two different fish. Ah, uh, it's just a big mosquito fish. But look at this guy. Super nice little black and gold molly right here. We're gonna get him in our hand real quick. See what else could be in here. Seems like another mosquito fish. Nothing too crazy. I'm not even seeing any cichlids in here. But that's a cool find. We'll get this guy in our little keeper cooler, and then we can't net anymore. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> The wish list is linked below. I'll have more nets on there if you guys want to support the channel. This net was kick ass, so I'm probably going to throw a few more on there because, like, they're really nice. I recommend you guys get yourselves a few. But we're going to get this black and gold molly in our in our keeper cooler, and then we're going to check the fish trap because now I can't fish anymore, but I'm not even mad about it. Like, I'm actually kind of hyped. We've been killing it out here. This canal is loaded. So right here, guys, we got this black and gold molly. We're just going to drop him in right here, and then we're going to pull up the trap and see if we caught anything in there. It hasn't... In it hasn't really been in there for too long, maybe like an hour or so. So we'll see what it does, see if we caught anything. I'm expecting a lot of little fish, but hopefully we caught lucky and got some of those exotics. We got this little mosquito fish right here. <laughs> He's going back home, but we're gonna pick up the trap right now. You see it? It's trying to get it. It's trying to find uh, somewhere to put its foot. Oh, he's holding hands with me. Oh, <laughs> is he gonna try to climb on me? Wait, that is so sick. Oh no, he's trying to go away. I'm sorry, buddy. Oh, look at that bug. All right, we're back at the trap though, guys. I got a little <laughs> distracted by that. Can we see anything in the trap right now? Oh, oh, I see a bigger fish in there. I see one of those really cool little barbs off rip already. We're gonna pull this up, see if we caught anything in here. Let's see, let's see, let's, oh, wow. Yup, 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 yup. Yeah, this is it. Wow, look, oh my God. <laughs> oh, he's splashing, he's splashing. Look at that. We got a ginormous garami. Dude, you couldn't miss him if you tried. We didn't catch any little ones while we were fishing, but this one is ginormous. We're gonna get the caper bucket over here. I'm gonna kill the aerator because it's kind of annoying and loud. But we got this giant garami right here. That thing is sick. I just got chewed on again. The bugs here are also really bad, but oh, wow. Look at this jewel. Some nicer colors on this one. This isn't as pretty as they get, but that's pretty good. Oh, guys, I'm gonna try to shut up and just pick up all these fish. I'll pick up as many as I can hold because I'm seeing a lot of cool stuff. Cichlids and platies, mollies, I don't know, whatever you want to call them. We got two of those black and gold ones, two more. That is, oh, buddy, buddy, <laughs> took a tumble. We're gonna get him in the cooler as well. Oh, look, we didn't even catch one of these in the net. We caught a fire mouth in the trap. These things are pretty sick. Oh, we got a bigger one at the house. We'll put him in there, mosquito on my chest. <laughs> It looks like everybody, oh, wait, <laughs> I'm losing my voice a little bit. Wow, this is definitely a convict cichlid. Uh, I think it might be a pink convict, but that is super sick. We're gonna get him in the bucket. Guys, stop hiding from me, please. We're getting chewed on. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Look at this, nice male jewel cichlid. This is what they grow into. All those little fish we were catching, that's a nice adult male jewel cichlid, an invasive fish from Africa. Another one of these nice barbs. We got two more in this trap. Beautiful little fish. They got such a sick barb. I think we're gonna keep these in my tank as well. Throw them in the keeper bucket. Oh, wow, look at that another pink convict oh yeah, let's go like i just can't there's so many fish in this canal this is ridiculous i see a lot of little cichlids cooler exotic ones at that cooler than the uh jewel cichlids i'm just gonna try to pick up all of them oh yeah oh yeah this is it this is this is it this is fire we found the badoshi <laughs> right here look <laughs> at all the jack dempsey's that were in the trap and another little fire mouse cichlid a lot of really cool fish these guys are beautiful we're gonna get them down in there and honestly, we might keep a few. Typically, current day, you know, I do give a lot of fish away to like local friends. Um, but when there's stuff I really like that I could actually keep and I'll go well with my tank, I do keep them for myself. I did keep those gourami in the fire shrimp from last video. I just accidentally, like the exporter didn't include that clip, but I showed it in the beginning of the video. So you guys know already. Anything, oh, <laughs> look. Another little Jack Dempsey, dude, that's sick. Anybody else? Oh, nice. Beautiful little jewel cichlid. He's still got some growing to do, but that is gorgeous. And anybody else? Any more cool little fishies? Oh, no way. No way. He's so fat. He is literally so fat. I love these things, dude. It'd be worth coming back here just to catch these fat balloon mollies. That thing is gargantuan. <laughs> like, literally, Butterball is such a good name. <laughs> like, that is so good. We're gonna get him in there. I'm trying to see, is there anything? Oh, another little fire mouse cichlid. Beautiful little fish. We're gonna get him in the bucket now. Let's see. Oh, another little pink convict cichlid. This is 
literally ridiculous cat food and a juicy spot will produce some crazy finds so super hype we're gonna get him in there as well is that a little jack dempsey yep <laughs> a little jack dempsey okay that's kind of ridiculous <laughs> i'm not seeing any more cool fish or cichlids in here guys i see a bluefin killifish we didn't catch one of those yet so a couple new species identified at the new spot we're gonna dump the cat food and dump these fish back in the canal and then we're gonna uh keep what we can give away what we will and yeah super fire new spot guys if you want a part two you want to see more videos at this location like and subscribe i'm going to be going crazy trying to find new locations for us to be fishing at so you know stay tuned to the channel turn on post notifications all that good stuff we're going to get these guys all packed up and head back to the house and before we actually add the new fish into the 55 gallon tank i'll roll the clips of adding the garami and the shrimp into the 55 gallon all right guys and we are now back at the house ready to add some of the fish into the 55 gallon tank now this isn't the scape thing the scape thing is going to be in the 150 gallon aquarium with the mini monster fish although they will be moved out at some point to accommodate the new scape but we have some new fish that we caught for the 55 gallon tank now right as of right now guys there's just a bunch of anubias and just some random stuff in here that we've caught throughout some of the past videos but we're going to be putting the shrimp and the honey gourami in here the rest of the fish we're going to be rehoming to a friend so i'm going to get these guys caught out and we're going to get them added into the tank so we got all these little shrimp we're going to be adding into this tank we're gonna see how they do um i'm gonna try to release them on the plants just in the event that any of the fish try to get frisky with them but we got five little shrimp right here so we'll see how they do um the platies and stuff really shouldn't bother them there are some crebensis cichlids in here that might bother them but for the most part they should be good and they should explode with all this hair algae and all these plant covers and i don't think it's necessarily the best idea to have three plus honey garami in the same tank but i really do love honey garami they're very cute little fish i already have two established in this tank so i know these two, three will do just fine and now that you guys saw that we're going to be adding in the new fish we caught into the 55 gallon tank we've got all these adorable little dumplings in here i mean we're gonna keep a little bit more fish than i had originally intended but look at these these guys they're so chunky i love them so we're going to add them into my little community tank right there and look at, <laughs> look at that thing they're literally so fat it's pretty adorable like literal meatballs right here i love these little fish i'm not sure if they can crossbreed with the normal one but we're gonna get all of them in the tank just because why not we're also gonna be adding in these barb things as well i'm pretty they look like a barb so i'm just gonna call them a barb but we'll add them in the tank as well just because they have such good color on them i'm like really into these guys so we're gonna dump these guys in here as well and now the 55 gallon tank is looking pretty colorful pretty fun so we're gonna keep just catching fish for it probably anything we could throw in here we will and that is it for today's video guys also i might make an of an only fins account so if that's something you're interested in stay tuned for a community post with the link i'll eventually plug it if i actually do decide to make one but like i'm thinking about it why not you know what i mean so that is it for today's video guys if you want to see a part two make sure you like the video subscribe channel and turn on post notifications i hope you enjoyed and i'll catch you guys in the next one deuces